You are now tuned in to Blunt Sessions. Blunt Sessions. Eat a dick, Al. Radio. You know what time it is. You've heard the other podcasts. Now make way. I'm gonna, one day I'm going to make a real stupid-ass intro like these other bum niggas have. That's my man. You know. How you feel? I'm Gino Lexus. K-Swiss. And I'm Sergeant General. You're listening to Wait a Blood Round of applause for everyone in attendance. Yeah. Surgeon General at the helm of this plane that is destined to crash in some grassy knoll somewhere <laughs> in the middle of the United States. The grassy knoll. Grassy knoll. Somewhere. Probably out there in Iowa. Forgive me for what I'm about to do to you children. Brother Latino heat is in my face. Yep. Was it in Iowa where it crashed or was it Pennsylvania? What are you referring to, Swiss? 9-11. Oh, did you have to bring 9-11 into this? I don't know. You did said you have to crash, bring 9-11? You said plane crash in a field. Yeah, I know. I said a grassy knoll. I put two tragedies together. Never forget, Swiss. Never forget. You say Anyways, you both full. Both full off to my right shoulder. What up? Kind of off to the ear, my earlobe. Okay, Swiss, right where he needs to be. In the rear. In the, the rear. rear. You like that? Yeah. Something wrong. Not for everybody in the building. Not at all. Yep. Not at all. Ladies and gentlemen, let's apologize ahead of time. Half the staff tonight is on zombie mode. You're majority. Small. Go ahead. Majority. Pull out the I'm good. You're you know, chilling, small. You know, can we just can there. we just be like tired without you telling everyone? Whatever. We all can't be vim and vigor, brother. <laughs> Latino heat. <laughs> This is, you know, Gino Lexus. Oh, my fault, Swiss. Go ahead. No, it's kind of odd that Alf has the most energy out of everybody. Because usually most shows, it's like the other way around. Yeah, he's usually just sitting there on his phone, not saying nothing. Yeah, just sure. He's taking Gino Lexus's place, who is in Haiti right now. Shout out to Gino Lexus. Really? The Haitian sensation in Haiti. Is he in Haiti or is he in the Dominican Republic? He's in Haiti. I think he's in Haiti, right? Right now. He didn't walk over the line yet? No. We don't know. We don't know. We don't know. Well, cross he's, on that that world, line. he's on that worldwide tour right now. Shout out to Gino Lexus doing his damn thing. Because when he crossed that line. Well, uh, yeah, I got you to save, save you. you. <laughs> <laughs> I got a hope for the killers. <laughs> <laughs> Let me offer that paper. Yeah. Coming yeah, from yeah, a live from Christ. Christ. Man, that beat was so hard. Yeah. I'm going to throw that on the mix now. Matter Rick, of fact, I'm probably going to lead the mix off. Thank you, Swiss. Yeah, Rick Ross. Cross that line. Oh, I know. I'm about to find out right now. We're going to lead off this show. Thanks, K-Swiss. Yeah. Matter of fact, real. you can just go ahead and pick all the songs. There you go. Oh, really? So how, how about if anybody wants to contact us, where are they going to reach us at? Can I pick the song first? <laughs> Hold on a so. second. I'll tell you in a second. I guess so. Or you can tell them right now. Yeah, go ahead, brother Latino. He tell them. If you'd like to call in here to the station. Yeah, you know, see, Renee is way better. Yeah, I know, ain't it? No, nah, but go ahead. <laughs> you can contact us at 813-720-1527. Or if you have music that you'd like to submit it into the radio station uh-huh. for us to play on the air, please send it MP3 format to flowhioradio at yahoo.com. That's flowhioradio at yahoo.com. F L O H I O R A D I O dot com. Well, well done. Well done. Actually, you can reach us on Twitter and Facebook and Instagram and, and you know. I'll tell know. you what though, it sounds way better like this. Hey, hey, yeah, I'm talking to you. You got something to say? You wanna get your music played? You wanna be on gone in 90 seconds? <laughs> Well, hit us up then. 813-720-1527 or email us at flowhioradio at yahoo.com. Hey, yo, wait. Run that back. 813-720-1527 or email us at flowhioradio at yahoo.com. We waiting on you. Okay, guys. So you hear it? No. 
I'm letting everybody in the curtain. You guys hear that buzz in the background? That's that's my mic. No, no, I don't hear anything. Anyways, uh, you're tripping. A little bit. You, you hey, really, you really you are. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you just. Hey, we have you don't some... hear the buzz. No. I don't hear nothing. Okay, listen. Watch. I'm gonna cut my mic. Nope. You don't hear that buzz. No, you guys no. are tripping, man. Don't don't act yeah, like you don't too, hear that. You're too into the technical part, right? Now. I know, and, it, and really. it's killing me. Yeah, you're we have some special me, beverages that. You're killing thank me. Thank you for small. reminding me. I was just about to jump into the mix. Yeah. Who wants some Zima? Yeah. Whoops, yeah. yeah. I spiked everything. Yeah. Who wants some Zima? Totally yeah. into it. Vote a fool if you could, please, sir. Reaching to the Flow Ohio Blood Sessions refrigerator located at the Jungle House on the Hillsboro River. In Tampa, we are Florida. now in the Entertainment Center, and we are about to go back 20 years in time, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, 20 years in time. Might even from might even be to the day, actually, now that I really? think about it. Yes. Seamus. To the day. Hey, because in 97. Day. No, okay, it wasn't. Because I was 18 after the fact. <laughs> Never mind. But we're sure. close. We're like 19 years. Bro, Bo- 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 I was calling Bo Latino Heat. Bo- <laughs> Capital Latino L. Heat. I think there might be... Tw- they're twists off. I'm over yeah. here trying to use a bottle opener they're with a twist, twist off. We're a douchebag. If you could Special. please, Bo, Latino Heat. What? Technically, Capital Latino Heat. I'm looking if you could get that go right behind you, get that bag of Jolly Ranchers, please. I'll play a little background music. Hold All right, on. Maybe, I wasn't, maybe I wasn't old enough or something, but citrus beverages? Are Zima's like the first They're like Sprite. Off? They're like Sprite. Are they the first Smirnoff Ices? Kind of. These are the first Smirnoff Ices. Kind of in a way. Because Smirnoff was more like an opaque color. Well, Smirnoff, but, well, Smirnoff was always a vodka first. All right. Yeah. It was just a vodka. It's the same company that makes the vodka, but what, looking at Zima, because these were out when I was a kid, so I didn't really have Zimas. Hey, you know what? You got that green apple over there, bro? I got a green apple. You have to go in. I got two of them. I usually do like three or four. I'm a cherry. I'm a to try be cherry. honest, bro. Try I've cherry. Never, I've never done. I've always done green cherry. apple because I like green apple. Green yeah, apple is my favorite. Or watermelon. You know what? Nah. Throw them back but, in. Yeah. Don't throw be back in. Don't no, no, be no, no, all no, no. stereotypical. No, don't put it in yet. Look. We should, oh, we should just fucking pull it out. Blindly pick. Yeah. You just Damn put it. You just put a green apple in. I didn't yeah. put it in. All right. Yeah. I'm gonna save this for later. Exactly. All right. So we're just gonna blindly grab one. We're gonna blindly grab. Oh, this is the Zemo roulette. <laughs> Yo, who's ready? Yeah. Holy shit! I don't know, man. <laughs> this is actually kind of scary because I hate grape. Uh, I just pulled out a grape. That was funny. All right, that's what made me think. Oh, really? I'll okay. go first. I'll go yeah, first. Yeah, I was gonna say you're gonna go first. Please, God, give me a cream. Fuck ah. the shit! <laughs> go ahead, throw right, that right, one in there. I said grape. Yep, right there. I said I hated grape, but guess what? I get a fucking grape. He got a watermelon. Watermelon, yeah. All right, let's Holy see. crap! Oh shit! Where you at, Bo? Is there a certain? I am. Why not? Cherry, baby. I'm tired as it is. Ew. Come on, just have a fucking Zima. It's like four percent, bro. It's like You're a good. baby, baby drink. All right, well, here goes. Come on, Bo. Cherry. Damn, well, look I don't at want that. A fucking purple. I don't look want that. grape, bro. It's too late. That's what you picked. Yep. Come on, Bo. Pick up a fucking Zima. Why you always got to not participate in everything? Why you got to be that guy, that one cool kid who's like, fuck, I don't want to be like, I don't want to be yeah, like. That's dope. He's like the emo. Way you, guys you know, it's funny. You remember no, just having... let it sit. You got to let it sit for a little bit. Let it sit for a little yeah, bit. Shake it, shake it up every once in a while. If you want to taste it to see what it tastes like, go right ahead. Yo, I've never. Uh, yeah, I've never had Because you've never had, had one, so try it without it. Just take a sip. Damn it, I got to put a grape in here. I hate grape. Grape is like the worst, yeah, it's worst flavor off. ever. It's mm-hmm. a smeared off ice. Yeah. Fuck. Ooh, so, you know what we could do? Let it sit for a couple of minutes and then drop another one in. Another another so blind another like, random flavor. So another random one? Yeah. No, that'd be dope if you got two grapes. One sip. <laughs> oh, God, right? Okay, so what we'll do, well, it is 10, 13 now. All right. All right. So in five minutes, which is 10, 18, we'll do another blind. We'll do a swig and then another blind drop. Okay. All and right. then after that, that'll be it because you don't want to let it get warm because they taste like shit when they're warm. Yeah, just like, I'm not going to keep saying it. Yeah, I know. Shout out to Zima. Hey, hit us up. Flow High Radio at Yahoo. We would love sponsorship. Do they even still make? These well, are li- I guess they obviously limited do. release. These are limited release. Oh, really? Yeah, that's why I'm kind of hoping like Zima sticks around. For, or didn't they turn into? They probably turned into something else. No, no, it's Zima. They were their own, they were their own company. 
Yeah. Well, I don't think they were in their own company, but they probably. Uh, I don't think. They yeah, were. I don't know how I missed the whole Zima revolution. Because you weren't white, Swiss. Ah. It's one that- of these. You weren't white, and you weren't in Northeast Ohio. Oh, is that what happens? Yeah. You're either white or you're Northeast Ohio. That's how you like it. Yeah, I guess since I was black and from Jersey, it's not but 40 ounces. <laughs> Basically, old English. <laughs> Bitch, what are you talking about? St. Ives. Are you crazy? I was an old English guy. No, bro. It was, it was I, I mean, I didn't drink it. I just remember Wu-Tang was always singing it. They sang, they sang about uh, St. Ives. They did the commercial for St. Ives. All right. So, uh, I'm going to play up? a little music in a little bit. Right now, I got a... I'm just watching my Zima do its I just thing. Still, it's funny because I just remember that song. Remember the go get the S the T I D E S. <laughs> oh, from the, from the loonies. Shit. They spelled Saint Eyes. Go get the S the T I D E S. Nevertheless, I'm hella fresh, rolling joints like okay, a cigarette. cigarette. Yeah, I never knew that they were spelling Saint Eyes. Saint- <laughs> wow, you really didn't. My mind has just been blown right now, bro. That the loonies were spelling out St. Ives. Ives. I yeah. did not know that. Holy Don't shit. Don't get the S, the T, I, D, E, S. All right. This yeah, there were, there were so many rappers singing about St. Ives. I, yeah, but I never caught that. That's crazy. Oh, yeah, coming through with my Shaolin crew. Two cent for a case. Give me St. Ives, bro. In the midst of broken bottles and crushed up cans. Met the cow. Killed that jam. Oh, how dry I am. Yeah. <laughs> I remember that when I was a kid. That was all St. Ives. Wow. Yeah. Well, interesting. So we got to let me play this uh, real quick. I guess that would be the next thing to try and find now would be St. Ides. Let me cover <laughs> my answers because we got a pretty dope show today and I don't want both stealing my shit. Yeah, cause I'm, I'm, I'm all about that. Let we're going to uh, do 10. I'm going to do play some music and then we're going to do remember the time music park where we went to the first went to a music park. Good God. Way to stumble remember. through that. Yeah. I haven't even drank anything. This is the best part. It's the anticipation. I'm anticipating drunk. Yeah, really? I'm like pre-drunking. From a, from a great... What they call it? From premature a, a drunkulation. That's right? a new fucking term. Hashtag. That's when you get drunk before you drink. E-drunkulation. Premature, premature e-drunkulation. e-drunkulation. That means, okay, let me get drunk. But it's like I... you feel drunk before you even had a sip. All right. Amusement Park. Virginity Lost, okay. a.k.a. when you went to the amusement park for the first time that you remember... Really? That's what you're calling it? The amusement park virginity loss? Yeah. I guess. Because eventually, because every time after that you got fucked going yeah. to amusement parks, it just wasn't the same? Well, yeah, it just was It just was for fun after that. The first time it was just for curiosity, you know? Really? Or to express your love. First time you go amusement to an amusement park, it's fucking dope as shit. What are you talking about? I know. I know, Swiss. I was just trying to create sexual innuendo conversation. Yeah, but you're not doing a good job of it. Terrible. Yeah, you do a great job pointing that out. Thanks, buddy. No, no problem, man. Middle Finger Club. After that, Gamer's Guide, Adventure Games. We found out today that Adventure is not a platform. It's just the, the, the way the game is presented. Thanks, Bo, to Fool, for that. No problem. Even though you were wrong, we had to tell you. But it is what it is. What the fuck after that? <laughs> and then to keep the Adventure theme... Top three adventurers, which I'm covering up my answers now because Boza answer stealer. Yeah, yeah, right, sure. Whatever you got to tell yourself. And the rest of the show, we don't know what we're going to do. But I do know one thing. It's time. It's time for the sip. Y'all ready? Give it a little shake or a little a little twist, if you will. Is, is that why? Oh, yeah, hey, it's cool. Turn kind of reddish. Yeah, it changes the color of the Zima. How come mine's not change? Because. Mine's changed. I know, well, I, that's what I was noticing with mine. Yeah, mine's not mine's not doing shit. All right, his is doing shit. Mine Maybe is. the red one is like right. way more food coloring. This shit is way more active. There you go. Cheers. Oh, I can't. Uh, I can't reach. There you go. I did it for you. There we go. All right, cool. Here we go. All right, here we yeah. go. Oh. 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 Wow. God. I forgot how bad this shit tastes. Yeah. <laughs> it's like you take two things that you hate and you put them together. You make, you know this what? Right here. This right here makes me shout out Smirnoff for getting it right. Because I hated Zima without the Jolly Ranchers. I hate the Grape Jolly Ranchers. That's so like a double negative, but it's not positive. So what you're saying is it's it like don't a, not taste it good. It don't matter. I hate it. It don't not taste good. Time for me to get the next Jolly Rancher. All right. 
<laughs> this is interesting. Please, God, give me green. Once again, shout out to Smirnoff. Fucking watermelon. I'll take that, though. 